Hey guys, well today we're in Pigeon Forge and look behind us, Krispy Kreme. We say it every time we're down here that we come in Krispy Kreme because they have a new lineup and this is no different. They have a fall collection. There's three new ones and three returning favorites. We're gonna pick those up, take them back to the room and try them. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Here are the new donuts. The spiced apple filled is sold out. We'll have to come back out and get them. Cinnamon latte lover, classic blackberry crisp. Where else? We got one. Pumpkin spice. And this is the one I'm looking forward to. The caramel pecan brownie. We just made it back from Krispy Kreme and we got five of the six. One of them's basically a Halloween one. We'll talk about that here in a second. Again, we are missing one, the apple spiced donut. We're going to go back and try to get that one. Yeah, that one must be popular because it was sold out. It had plenty of the other ones. Maybe that's why it's a returning favorite. Must be. All right, Bobby, we have three new ones in there and two returning favorites. Which one are you going to go with? I'm going to try this one first. All right. Let's talk about that one. Bobby chose one of the new ones, the Cinnamon Latte Lover Donut. Here's what it says about it. Latte lovers enjoy your favorite fall drink donut style. This donut is dipped in cinnamon icing. See that on there? That's topped with a dollop of cinnamon latte buttercream. Plenty of that and a autumn leaf candy piece. We were told that's the best one by that person mm -hmm. that waited on it. She yeah. said that's her favorite out of all the new ones. Probably doesn't mess me up the taste-wise because I'm drinking coffee, but we'll see. And you like coffee, so I got a funny feeling you're gonna like that. There is a lot of icing on this. Look at all the buttercream, the cinnamon. It's gonna be sweet. Not too much sugar on the bottom, though. Mm-mm. It says cinnamon latte lover donut. What do you think? Are you a lover of that donut? I like the cinnamon icing on this. The latte buttercream, I do not like. It has too much of a strong coffee flavor. I think it would be good if they had like a maple buttercream on this one. Is it the candy? Piece. I'll try that. Try it. I like the candy piece. It's thin, it's a little sweet. I'll save that for you, John. I think this would be a good donut if they would just change up the buttercream, like I said, maybe to a maple flavor. I think it was decorated very pretty with that maple leaf. It was, but maybe different coffee lovers would like that. You know what? I'm going to try it, and I hate coffee. And I don't think it was as sweet as I thought it would be. One reason I'm trying this is because I don't think I've ever had a Krispy Kreme donut that I didn't like. I mean, I like them all. There's some I like better, but this one I don't think I'm going to like at all. Let's try it. This is going to be the first time that I've ever said Krispy Kreme, this donut is terrible. There's no way I could eat this donut. That just tastes like coffee. I know that cinnamon, I get no cinnamon flavor out of that. And even the donut, which I like, the Krispy Kreme donuts, I can't even taste that. Horrible for me. I don't think it's a horrible donut. Mm. Um, I think where you took a bite, you got a lot of I that did. icing. I think you would like that cinnamon icing flavor. Maybe I'll take another bite. I'll do that off camera because I gotta get that taste out of my mouth. Next up, the pumpkin spice cake donut. It says it's one of our fall fan favorites. This glazed old fashioned pumpkin spice cake donut is the perfect combination of crumbly cake and pumpkin spice flavor. And it looks pretty good, especially with all that vanilla icing on top of it. First thing I noticed when I picked this up, this is a heavy donut. It's heavier than some that are cream filled or jelly filled. There's the bottom of it, but look at all that glaze. I'm anxious to try this one. This is so much better than that first one. It's crispier. It's not airy like the regular Krispy Kreme donuts. It is so sweet with all that glaze in there. Still, like I said, it's very heavy. I do like this, and the pumpkin spice flavor just flows through on this strong pumpkin spice flavor. Well worth getting. Did a good job on this one. 
Since this is the returning favorite, I have to try it. The cake donuts are heavier because they are made with the baking powder where the other ones have the yeast in them. I like this donut. It's better than the first one. It is a little sweet, but you definitely get that pumpkin spice flavor coming through. All right, let's look at this one. This looks like one we've had before. Chocolate ice with autumn sprinkles donut, but it looks to me almost like the Halloween one we had. I think they're getting rid of a lot of their Halloween sprinkles. I think they're missing the yellow sprinkles on this for the autumn, but here's what it says. This is our original glazed donut dipped in chocolate icing and topped with autumn sprinkle blend. It's pretty colorful, just not what the picture looks like. Done this one several times in these videos, but I'll go ahead and take a bite because it still looks good and I like the chocolate ice donuts. Before you take a bite, oh. <laughs> sorry. Is there a lot of glaze on that donut? There is. I can okay. see it shining in the light. Wish you guys were here to try all these with us. We could use some help. Mm -hmm. Nothing fancy about this. It's your basic chocolate ice Krispy Kreme donut, but I like it. But you know, I read a lot of comments that people don't like the chocolate ice from Krispy Kreme. They like the original one better. I like this one better than the original one. Sweet crunchiness from the sprinkles that are on there. I think every time they bring out a new fall or Christmas or whatever lineup it is, they just put a chocolate ice out and sprinkle stuff on it, just different colors. And again, I think this one's missing the yellow ones. We're going with the new classic Blackberry Crisp Filled Donut, inspired by Blackberry Crumble from Grandma's Kitchen. This donut has blackberry filling, is dipped in cinnamon icing and topped with granola, so that should have the same icing as that nasty tasting <laughs> latte one, Bobby. So I will be able to taste some cinnamon, hopefully, in this. I'm gonna cut this so we can see what it looks like inside. I don't have a knife, but this was my coffee swirler that I had. It does fare, I it guess, does. as a knife. And this is the end, John, that I did not put in the coffee. All so. right. I don't care. Oh, look there you at go. that. Now that looks good, guys. Light, airy donut. That is very good. Look at all the blackberries, John. It's even coming out on this side. It is. When I first taste it, the blackberries, it's a little tart, but when you get the cinnamon and the donut, it's a sweet flavor. Get the crunch from the granola. Very good donut. So far, this is my favorite. That's the one I was excited about, but that brownie one, we're saving. That's why we got two of those to make it an even half dozen. Looking forward to this one. Guys, that's a sweet donut also. Now I can really taste the cinnamon icing on this blended in with that blackberry. And I think the blackberry is sweet. And it's a little chewy with that granola coming through with that great Krispy Kreme donut flavor. Another good one. I don't know yet. Old fashioned this one. I don't know which one I like better. One more brownie batter. Let's go with another new one. The caramel pecan brownie donut. Cozy up with our original glazed donut dipped in delicious brownie batter icing and topped with candied fall pecans and a salted caramel drizzle. I don't know, looks pretty tasty. First of all, there is no Krispy Kreme vanilla glaze icing on this. It's just gonna be straight brownie batter. They should take this brownie batter and put it inside of a filled donut. Maybe they have, I just don't remember, but I bet you it's gonna be good. You can really taste those pecans in there. Now, you know this brownie batter, I was expecting this to be so sweet, and it's not. It's very good, but it's not overly sweet. The donut itself is it's like a Krispy Kreme donut, airy, a little crispy. So I do like this one, but I don't think this is gonna be my favorite, surprisingly. But I would like to try that batter by itself. The pecans on there really overshadow the brownie batter. They didn't skimp on the pecans or pecans, depending on where you're from. Another good donut. I like the brownie batter they put over top of this. And like John said, there's none of that Krispy Kreme icing that they usually have on it, which I'm glad they didn't because that way it's not overly sweet. Very good donut. All right, let's take a look at our receipt here at Krispy Kreme in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. 11 for a half a dozen. 
but since we got those specialty donuts, it adds an extra 20 cents each to them. And the reason it says 40 is we got two of the brownie ones. Grand total, 1602. We just tried five out of the six new items for the fall collection at Krispy Kreme. Three of them are brand new, three returning favorites. One of them we didn't get. We're gonna try to slip in there again this week and pick that one up and we'll put it in this video. What did you think, Bobby? The latte donut, unless you like coffee, and I mean strong coffee, don't get that one. I didn't care for that one at all. And I do drink coffee. All right, so we tried them all then. So which one was your favorite? Mine would be the Blackberry Crisp. I like the cinnamon icing on it. It wasn't overly sweet and the granola over top of it. That made it chewy. Tough decision for me because I did like that one. And I like the brownie batter. Wasn't as sweet as I thought it would be. But I'm going with a returning favorite, the old fashioned pumpkin spice. That pumpkin spice shined through. Very sweet donut with all that Krispy Kreme glaze. I like it's a cake donut because I like cake donuts. But they were all good except the <laughs> one. No way I would ever get that. And we haven't tried the apple spice filling one yet, and we're gonna try to do it. So maybe it'll be better than the ones we picked. If it is, we will let you know. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J and B have Hi. left the building. Hold it one second. Haven't done that for a while. Put you in the matrix. These donuts are only available, I think, until after Thanksgiving, and then the Christmas ones come out, and we are sure to go back and try those later. Well, we came to a, another Krispy Kreme to try to find that spiced apple-filled donut. Let's see if we can find it in here. Well, we got lucky, and they have a few of them left. Let's just pick it up and eat it here. Returning favorite spiced apple filled donut. If you skip apple picking, pick up this donut tossed in cinnamon sugar and apple cider flavored filling. And this one was hard to find. This one was usually sold out instantly, like in the first two hours of the store opening. I'm gonna cut it to see what's inside. There's no knife, so I have to use the sort thing to, for the coffee. Boy, oh, look at that. The apples. Filled it up, didn't it? did. I see why this is hard to get, Dawn. These are selling very quickly. I do enjoy this one. I like the cinnamon sugar on top of the donut. It's very fresh. The apples, I really like that inside. They, they put plenty in there. You get a little bit of taste of the apple cider that's inside. I like it. But it's not overly sweet. Are you sticking with your original blackberry one as your favorite or that one now that we've tried them? I'm gonna stick with the original blackberry, but this would be second. The first part of this video you watched was filmed three days ago. That's how long it took us to find one of these. We kept going back and going back. They never had it. It was always sold out. Finally found it today, so I hope it's worth the wait. It says it's apple cider filling instead of apple pie filling. I can see why. When you taste it, you just get a strong flavor of apple, but that aftertaste, you can taste a little bit of that cider. That cinnamon sugar on there, you can taste a little bit of that, but the apple still comes through. Probably why it's sold out, because once you eat one, you're gonna get them the next time you come back. But I'm still sticking with my original winner, the Old Fashioned Pumpkin Spice one. And this one's not overly sweet, is it? It is not, but it is very good. And the price for the one donut, $2.42. So now, this video is finally over.